I've got something I want y'all to do again with me. <laughs> Let's do this again. It worked so well when we did this last year. We did this last year the same day. Same day. And I just happened to stumble upon this. On YouTube, I was going through some of my videos, and it was something about the video was, help me, help me. And I said, what, is, what was I asking for help for? And I listened to the video, and that was me asking for help with a fast. And the fast <laughs> was just a, a nine-day fast starting from... Uh, 11 at night, 11 and to 11 in the morning. It's just a 12 hour fast and you're sleeping most of the time. But uh, I just happened to stumble on that. And do you know that was a year ago to uh, starting on the 1st of August that I asked for help with that. And I said, it'd be a great time to do this prayer again. Let me turn this music down. But you know, do it again. When you when you're younger, you know what that means, what we were talking about, let's do it again on a sexual connotation. But something sometimes we have to remember the things that worked for us in the past. You have to remember how it was and you do it again. This prayer, I did this in the I guess it was in the nineties. I had been reading some, you know, when I was searching. Some prayers and uh, I ain't got on my glasses, my lenses. I need to get them straightened out so I can barely see. But I was doing this uh, fast in the 90s and it was working real well. And I had done it for probably three months in a row. And I was just about the end at the end of my nine days with this particular fast. And my oldest brother came. He was looking real bad. Drugs had did a number on him. He had plenty of money. That's, that was a problem. He had so much money. And he had already told me about how one of the big time dealers had put a gun to his head and the, and the gun didn't go off. And just many different things. He had fancy clothes, alligator shoes. And he smoked so much until he had to sell his shoes and come home barefoot so this particular time i said "Ooh, i'm just about through with my uh nine day fast i said but this boy needs this more than i do and i prayed and i asked the universe to bless him because he needed more than i did and i you know gave it and a plump forgot about it and i think maybe two months later i did another prayer but do you know, my brother, after that prayer, he went into a rehab. He had been in so many rehabs before. We, I can't even count them. He probably can't either. But that was the last rehab he went to. And he has been clean for a long time. Man, probably 30 years. Let's see, how long? Let's see. Isn't it weird because... He, we were using about the same time. So I guess we we have the same amount of uh, years. But this prayer works. And you could look it up. It's a St. Jude prayer. And if you're not particularly Catholic, you don't have to do that prayer. But I just grab anything that works. I might pray to St. Christopher, St. Jude, or anybody. Whoever you used to making your prayers to. But I'm going to do it again starting the first. I think it's the first of Sunday. So starting again at 11 o'clock Sunday night. And that's the first. And it'll end that the ninth, nine days of this prayer. And it's, it's not like you're going to be doing without a lot of stuff. It's just after 11 o'clock, you're not going to eat any food. You can drink water and maybe some juice or something, but 
it's the hard part would probably be 11 o'clock in the morning before you eat. You know, if you used to getting up having a hearty breakfast before you go to work, that would be the only part that would be hard. But those who of you who will, do this with me and just lay your desires on the altar, what you need. And I have a few things I'm just going to lay on the altar again. And, and I do know, not believe, I know that my prayer will be answered. So those of you who want to do it, do it. Let's do it again, okay? <laughs> I'll talk to you guys later uh, uh, after the ninth day, okay? Bye.